Hi everyone, this is William from SkySiv and in this video we're going to be looking at importing DXF files as a way to specify your custom shape. Now DXF stands for Drawing Exchange Format, so it was developed by Autodesk for the popular 2D package known as AutoCAD. However, it's also been used in 3D packages such as SolidWorks among others. Now, the handy thing about um, being able to import DXF files is if you prefer to sketch um, through CAD packages first rather than specifying the points of a point shape, you can do that um, through your CAD package, export a file into DXF and then import it into Section Builder. So importing a DXF file, I've created a hexagon in SolidWorks, saved it as DXF and imported the file here. So just as your other shapes, you can perform operations. I can rotate this, I can translate this in both directions, and I can mirror this just like I would any other shape. And I can perform a calculation on this hexagon. And you get the properties just as you would any other shape. Now, the important thing to keep in mind is that we only currently accept one polygon per DXF file and the polygon that you specify in your DXF file has to be made up of lines only so no curves at this point. So clearing that one other way to specify a DXF file is by utilizing our DXF exporter. So for example I'm going to be opening up S3D in a new tab And from this new tab, I'm going to be drawing with nodes a right angled triangle because at the moment you currently can't draw right angled triangles or there's no right angled there's no right angled template, only a isosceles template. So I'm going to be joining up these nodes. to draw my triangle. Now with my triangle I'm going to go into File, Export, DXF, Draw 2D Lines. Now I'm in the XY plane so I have to specify that and I'm going to set my 2D limits to negative 1 and 1 so it captures my my drawing and I'm going to export this and I'm just going to save this to my desktop I'm going to call this right triangle. Okay, so it's ready, ready and saved. Now I'm going to import the triangle I just drew. Import the XF file. Go to my desktop. Uh, right triangle here. And as you can see, I've just imported my right angle triangle. So this offers additional flexibility to import files from different packages or alternatively you can even create your own DXF files and import them back in here. So I hope this has been informative. Uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks and bye for now.